All right, hey there, everyone. Skull Calvary nonsense. Last time we, I wouldn't say I conquered hell, but I sure made my way through it. Uh, we also have the option of doing this other level called Hypogee and Athletic, which I've since learned just means underground. Underground Athletic. So now I am not allowed any power ups. Well, I could be big, I guess. Five star. Isso, I haven't played something by Isso in a very long time. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, we're going underground right here right in the pipe like I don't know man Like I I, I might have to oh we got, we got we got big wall We got hitting our corner Head hidden corner and we got a little guy And we got a blooper And we get a power up that I kind of want the pair of beetles. Oh, that's pretty scary Okay, well here we go Try to land on the blooper and it didn't work because I missed. Okay, yeah, this. Okay, uh, I don't think I have time for that power up. Ugh. So, try to land on. Oh, okay, you bounce, you don't. Ah, help. Mushroom down there. And messing it up here. Okay, here we go. Something is starting here. Oh, I tried to do a slide jump, but I guess I press jump too late. Whoa, wait a second. Uh, that shell went right through that blooper. Ugh. Honestly, that looks kind of hard. Der. Large. I mean, am I just gonna do that dance every time? Maybe. Oh, right. Oh! You need to use that shell to free that mushroom. And the shell just went right through it. Okay, so I can goad it like that. Alright. I don't know if I want this, but I can have it. And then just die immediately. So, not an auto scroller, but. Kinda. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, here is fine. Uh, here's me being slow. Here is me trying to jump, but I pressed a button too late. Ah! Wah! Ah! Is that an unironic ooh ah? Sure was. Wow, way to land on things, guy! Awesome job! <laughs> would I benefit at all from being big? I feel like I would not. Not in these early parts. Like, my deaths are falling, and being big would just make it easier to fall. Like, yeah, that one time I got oo-wad by a shell, but I can't define your entire strategy around a one-time event that now I know about. Why did I jump again? <laughs> I I didn't realize- I wasn't sure if I had uh, reached the ceiling. Like, it's- that's clearly made where you're not supposed to go up there. But also, it's not made where it just instantly kills you. So... I was so concerned with, oh no, I need to make sure I don't press the jump button too hard that uh, I barely tried to aim, which, uh, you know... Kind of not what I want to do. <laughs> Ah, no, I don't. I hate this. I hate this. Alright, I am putting a save state at the very start so that next time I press exit, I can just restart here instantly by pressing a button. You know what? Let's just live up here. Oh, wait, it doesn't matter. Wait, what? Wait, no, it doesn't matter. <laughs> just go up there. What? Wait.
It is interesting how completely the two five stars, like how different they are. Cause Yavo's level was just like, diff dude, just. I'm sorry, it's a reflex, but also it's like, I don't wanna die there, I just wanna, I wanna move on. Like, I'm not, okay, I died, cool. Let's, let's start again already. But yeah, like, like, uh, Yalp's level is like, pure saturation of stuff. It's a lot of like, interacting with sprites, and keeping you moving. This is very different. It's almost, as of now, the very least, pure just navigating a space and platforming. Like, there are enemies, but like, they're more hurdles to circumnavigate than like a proper thing to interact with. I think it's fascinating. Like, it is legitimately neat how just like completely different they are. Okay, no, yeah, I am completely now in my own head where I'm like, well, I don't want to go high enough, I don't want to go high enough, but then I just don't do anything because of that. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, modulation, modulated enemy bounces is, uh, the most obvious thing in the universe. Okay, cool. Yeah, then you just go like, yeah, like that, and then you're here, and you see that shell just, like, fly off. So, oh, hello, welcome to Crate World. Okay. Welcome to all the beetles in the universe, hang out here. Uh... Oh boy! Okay, well, progress. That's scary. I need to have, like, an amount of momentum. When I bounce on that blooper at the end, I feel like, but, um, like, I think that's what I felt. Like, I, like, I bounced straight up. Like, I didn't have any, like, side to my movement. And I, hmm. Still sticking to one hour, or if I encounter a midpoint rule, by the way, just figured I'd state that out loud. I mean, like, I'm assuming there's gonna be a midpoint, but I don't know that. This one could be also different in that way, and that there's just like, one big chunky boy. It could even not be that chunky, like, I don't know. Mind you, not even be soup. On the map, it is on water, though. Cray, it's a boy. It's so silly. It's a little, little time spender. A little time tax. Make sure you got here fast enough. Exact, exact, exact same death as last time. I don't have an angle when I bounce on the blooper compared to when I bounce on the beetle. Which makes me wonder if there's something about the physics of the blue the bloopers when you bounce on them that's different. You jump it and jump. Did I wait too long? So there I didn't go high enough. Pretty funny at the end of all this. There was a uh, like a yellow block you need to fracture, so you know you need to be big, actually. And that would force me to sort of like relearn everything with completely different size. Because yeah, like a lot of my jumps would have to change if I was forced to be big. was a bit aggressive. I want a shell. I need a shell in here. You know what? Let's do that. Uh, why did I jump there? Because I was panicking due to having like a death wall like around, uh, surrounding, around, uh, behind me. There you go. I finally said the correct relative position. Yeah, I said a new 
faster retry point. This is like the only real place. It's that and the very low drops that I am still struggling with at this point in time. Like, honestly, this is all very actionable. Whoa. Oh, it's fine. What? Yeah, I feel, yeah, like, I, I feel like I really... I have died, like, a couple of times through enemy contact, but... I really don't think I want to be doing this big. I, I agree that I would have survived where I got last time. But I would argue that I don't know if I have made it that far yet. How did I mess up that jump? Of all things. Of all things to mess up. Like, really? That? Whoa! So just wait a little bit longer than you'd want to on the vine. Yes, you just get in... Uh, just, just one layer in. Makes the world a difference. I don't need you. I panic. I panicked! I panicked! I didn't- I- 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 ah! I panicked. Maybe keeping the shell for that guy, though, is the move I want to do. Hmm, I don't know. I don't know yet. I don't know. Whoa, I'm out somehow. I must have landed from the spin and then bought me from underneath. It's a good thing they can be bought, because otherwise I would have like, well, I'm a child. People on the internet would be, oh, you're rewarded for this behavior. Okay, see there, my timing was, I waited too long, and I didn't need to jump. <laughs> uh, it's fine, it's fine. It's the nuances that we're learning. So that at the end of the day, it's all behind me, and I can forget it all. <laughs> Welcome to the weirdest way to look at video games. It's not inaccurate! It's kind of pessimistic. Whoa, whoa, okay, well that's pretty sweet. matters all that much. Man, I just... I... Uh, I... I have... like a third of a second to make a decision of what to do there, and I just never make the right one. Yeah, like, the nuance between the winning move and the less winning move are very subtle. There, the jump didn't jump. Wow! Let's add that to the fun list. Oh, man, I missed a quick fail. No! Oh, just go here. It's fine. Uh... Uh... Oh, no, oh, man! Stupid vine! I was stuck on it! Ah! Okay, well, a little bit further. Things stay ridiculously scary. It's getting close to my time limit, but I don't feel like stopping yet. I mean, I'm not there yet. Too, but I think 
think I nailed my Merde, no. Like I'm pretty sure I would have beaten at least whatever is up to the next midpoint. If I could just get that beetle string with the roof section. Like if I could just do it. By now. Because that has just been the stopgap for so many attempts. Like, again, like, I get incidental deaths like that from time to time, but, like, nothing on the level of Mr. Stopgap. Because also, like, you know, like, yeah, there I, I accidentally touch the muncher. It's fine. I know what I did wrong. I know what I'm normally doing. Oh, but Stopgap, though, it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just, Feels like I'm just thrusting my fate to fortune. I don't have a technique. Like, I can get up there sometimes, and it's great, and then there's like another kind of long section that I can do without any problem up until where it becomes new, where then I just get blindsided by something I didn't see coming. I don't mean that literally, I just mean that my processing speed is not fast enough. Um... Like, is it too late in? DUDE! I pressed down, but I was still holding up for some reason, and my, my left thumb just refused to let go. Why? I don't know. So there, I didn't have to hold jump at all, which is fascinating. I press jump. Like I need to hold down to 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 fall to that blue block. Uh, I hold it way too early. All right. Every time I die from there, that's when I restart. Cause I'm like, no. I could be. More on the money. Just doing that. You have more attempts here, and I'm I'm pretty sure I would have. Like I'd be done. Maybe I do want that shell to use that. Then I can get stuck here on the vine! Wow! That's a great time! So I am picking you up. Doing that. Then, why did you not jump off the vine? Like, you just did nothing! Eh, whatever. Dun! Really? That does not... I was not holding jump, to be fair. Sometimes that happens, that's a lot of fun. I want it to be a little bit higher. For some reason, it held in a better position to go into like that. Really? I mean, that felt super bad, so I hope that's not how I do that forever. Oh wow, actually I did not make it at all this time. That's... that's a new one. I don't... Uh, uh, I just... I don't... Once, once I'm there, I don't have time to think or, like, look at my environment and I just die from... Ugh! Come on, man! I can't do this! Just... I need to be able to get there more than once every 700 days. Like, that's my issue. Okay, I'm dying to like stupid, ridiculous things now, so... I think that's a sign that I need to stop. I know someone's going to be tempted to write that, Oh, wow, a video without any progress. It's That's not true. 
Like, we've played a lot of the level. And, like, I have a battle plan for a chunk of the level. Like, if you don't consider that progress, I don't know what to tell you. And, like, I'm fine with that. It's just that, you know... It's just weird ending a video. Yeah, without, like, a tangible point of thing, especially the first time I play one, but, I mean... I didn't expect to get anywhere in my first video of Nipple's level, so... Alright, no. Next death, no matter what it is, that's that's it. That's the end of the day. Like, it's clear that I'm just... I'm drained out. I'm not there anymore. Dying from small, little, incidental things, like, is just... It's a sign of something. I went on the lowest one, and the frame rate died for a hot minute there. The thing was, uh, shoot. So here I'm just too slow. Okay, okay. Oh, really? And I don't jump there because it's a slope and whatever. Whatever. It's fine. Whatever. I'll keep trying next time. Like, it's, it, that's a problem. Like, it's such a downbeat. Like, it's such a bad end, but I just, I have to be realistic, and I have to be better at respecting my time. So, yeah. Quit.